Welcome back, everyone. Joining me live in the studio, I have Pastor Carol Lee and Shakia Butler. They are with the Assembly in Jesus Christ Church out of West Point, and they're here to talk about uh, a young people's crusade. Did I get that right? You ladies? got it right. Absolutely. All right. Thank you for coming, by the way. And thank, thank you for you. having us. Absolutely. So let's talk about when this is happening. Go ahead and share with our audience. Well, we we our, our, our theme has been from the very beginning that we're calling all all youth, teens, young adults, and the young at heart. Very cool, young at heart. <laughs> I like that part. And we're calling them to what we call the Praise in the Kingdom Crusade, Young People's Crusade 2019. It's going to be on July 18th, 19th, and 20th. Nice. It'll be held at the Center of Jesus Christ Church. And you've already given that location, but just in case they missed 8191 US 45 in West Point, Mississippi. Okay. Um, just briefly going over what's going to be happening. On the 18th, we have two ministers coming out of Meridian, Mississippi nice. from the Revival Center. Okay. Uh, Grayson Pierce will be speaking at 2 p.m. and Brian Pierce will be speaking at 6. Music will be rendered by our, our recording choir, so nice. uh, the Assembly of Jesus Christ Ensemble. On that uh, Friday, the 19th, mm -hmm. Uh, the speaker will be Bishop Francisco Brock at 6 o'clock in the evening. Okay. And at 3 o'clock, we're excited because we have Evangelist Cooper coming. She is a, uh, has her master's degree in behavior health. Yes. And she's going to bring the young people a uh, different coping and stress, uh, a coping and stress workshop. Mm -hmm. So that will happen at 3 p.m. Nice. And then that evening at 6, we have recording artists. A lot of young people just got new recordings out. Nice. Uh, Felicia Cole Pope of Tuscaloosa, Alabama, and um, Nate Cole and Lady J of Decatur, Georgia. Nice. They will bring, be bringing us some of their new music along with our, our recording groups. And uh, we have a 12 year old coming from oh, Louisville, so Sade Swanigan, and we're excited in Monica Brock. Then, oh, let me ask you this one question mm -hmm. real fast. What are you hoping young people take away from being at this event and engaging in all the fun, seeing all the musical acts and talent? What are you hoping they take away? Well, I'm hoping that they will find something spiritual. Mm -hmm. uh, they will be encouraged as far as things that they've gone through physically, mm -hmm. uh, emotionally. Mm -hmm. It's been stressful. Um, I had the opportunity to meet a lot of the young people that were in this first time Mississippi uh, high school college program. Very nice. And in meeting them and them coming to the altar and asking for prayer, there were a number of things that troubled me. Mm -hmm. And I hope that this crusade will help bring some deliverances and, and some joys and some peace for these young people. Uh, uh, real quick, Ms. Butler, talk about uh, why is it important to, to support young people real fast? It's very important to support each other because we all depend on each other. We all need to lean on each other. That's where we'll find strength. That's where we'll find hope and aspirations. And that's where we all can reach our goals. So we need to pull on each other and that's why I feel like it's important to encourage one another. Very nice. All right, you see all the information right there. Please come on down uh, to the Assembly in Jesus Christ Church in West Point to take part in this event. Ladies, thank you for being here. Thank, thank you. you for having us. Absolutely. Let's send it over to Kendall Smith. She has a weather update for us.